All right, Greg, thank you. Many Americans are also concerned about how the situation in Ukraine will affect gas prices locally. Uh, they're already rising here in Tucson, and the price is going to go even higher, and it's been doing so every day. Nine on your side's Perla Sheen joins us now live from a local gas station to tell us how the crisis is impacting Tucson drivers. Perla. Well, I'm at the A&M Shell on Speedway, and the owner tells me that earlier this, uh, on February this year, the price for regular Shell gas was $3.16. Now, take a look at these prices. I mean, it has gone up to about $3.75, and this price is fluctuating even from earlier today. But despite these drastic changes, these are some of the lowest prices in town. Gas prices will vary by station, but here's what you'll pay at some of the pumps east of Wilmot Road. It ranges from $3.49 at Quick Trip and $3.74 at more top tier stations like Chevron. These same stations west of Stone Avenue are charging around 10 cents more per gallon. Even so, we're still doing better than California. It's so much cheaper. I wish I could put it in uh, five gallon buckets and take it back to California. <laughs> Data from the American Automobile Association shows that average gas prices in Tucson are up by around 22 percent compared to last year. The current average for a gallon of unleaded gas is $3.73. So these prices are going to continue to fluctuate and change, but as long as you want to save gas, you might want to stay east of Wilmot Road for now. All right, Pearl, I guess it is all relative. At least we're not paying over $6 a gallon like the woman you just talked to from California. Well, Pat, I'm from San Diego, or I'm from California. I have friends in San Diego, and I go down there pretty frequently, and that's where that woman is from as well. And they are seeing some of the highest prices in gas throughout the country right now. So maybe it's best to just fill up in Tucson and then head down there, try to not drive around the city. It's just, yeah, there's a lot of ways to uh, try to avoid those payments, but you have to, you have to stay in the city of Tucson. Yeah, exactly.